Hello everyone, this is Varun Dwey. I'm going to explain you how to use the group types and uh, how to create it and uh, what options we have available inside our plugin. After the BuddyPress 7.0 update, uh, we have new screen for the creation of the group types and it will allow you to create a group type and uh, I'm going to create a group type student. As a directory view indicate that it uh, will have a new URL on which uh, we can get all the groups which belong to a specific group type. Show on creation indicate that it will also be available as a selection option uh, when you are going to create a new group. Show on groups that means this, this group type will also be displayed on the group header uh, when you are opening a single group. So I have uh, created a group type with name is student. group so when we have all these options uh, so on groups create group option you can also modify these options from here next I'm going to assign couple of groups to this specific group type in group to group types student We have uh, these four groups assigned to the student group type. Now I'm going to view a single group and the group directory how it looks like. So on a single group we have a echo like uh, group type is equal to a student and when you are clicking on that one this link will be a clickable if uh, the URL parameter is enabled on that one. So group type is student it will display all the four groups which are assigned to it and when I'm going to all group tab uh, which is a group directory it will display all the groups which are assigned here and um, those uh, groups uh, which are assigned to a, a specific group type we do not have any filter here like uh, I cannot uh, find out uh, groups based on the group type suppose that we have couple of group types so it's a little bit here uh, complex here to filter them and that's uh, where we need uh, our plugin create group type it is going to extend the functionality of uh, the plugin the name is not relevant nowadays but uh, it's a old plugin that's why we are not changing it we are just adopting it to make it more compatible to the uh, standard WordPress version okay uh, I'm going to activate the plugin recent activated okay using this plugin you can also use the existing group type what you have already created with WordPress. You just have to modify them a little bit. I'm going to existing group type. So it's going to adopt your existing structure. What it have the same data values. So it's using the recent one. Okay. There are two options what we have introduced here. First, the pre-select option to create a, uh, when you are creating a group, you also are getting that group option pre-selected. Second, display it as a tab. So on the group directory, it will also display as a tab. Like this one, after enabling this option, I'm going to the group directory. Okay, now we have updated this option here. So now we have a group new tab here, student. It is going to display all those four types. I'm on the all groups again. Okay, so I can also filter based on the group type, like this one. We have four selection here. Now I'm going to create a new group type just uh, to display like it is going to display the different different values. So like teacher. I'm going to assign um, groups to this one. I'm going to modify one group and assign both group type to this one and add a couple of more to the type teacher and uh, when we have to assign multiple group type we have to jump uh, inside a single group and uh, we can update this option from the back end and the front end both 
multi assign is not available from the group directory from here like in the bulk action you can uh, apply only one at a time and you, if you are going to change it then it will change it is not going to multi assign those things okay so this group has a uh, two group type and uh, rest of them has single just reloading the page just to check it okay now you can see that uh, the matrix has the two group types and the rest of them are single now I'm going to the all directory okay now just have to confirm that we have enabled the teacher to list as a tab there Now we have teachers tab and student tab and now we can filter uh, clearly like uh, who is the uh, teacher who is the student now you can see that we have five items there and for the student we will have four items there like this one and matrix is coming in the both one and uh, using our plugin we are also displaying the group type on the group directory uh, by default uh, this group type was not displaying on the group directory page it is only displaying on the single group header okay hopefully you like the plugin and if you are looking for any new feature let us know if you find that the plugin is useful you can also drop a review on the our org url thank you